Welcome to Mickey's Kitchen. Today is the 357th day. I'll show you how to make hojicha cookies. I made sakura cookies before for my 336 YouTube video, which had a nice cherry blossom flavor. Today, I'm gonna replace cherry blossoms with hojicha or roasted green tea. Its rich flavor permeates your mouth. Well, let's get started cooking! First, bring unsalted butter to the room temperature. Next, grind hojicha leaves in a mortar. Then sift hoji cha. Then sift flour and mix with hoji cha powder. Next, mix softened butter and add granulated sugar. Then crack an egg and separate yolk and white. Then add 10 grams of yolk into the bowl. and mix well. Next, sift flour and hoji char again and add into the bowl. Then mix in a cutting motion with a rubber spatula. Okay. Then Roll the dough and make it cylindrical shape on cling wrap. And wrap it. Then let it rest in the fridge for one hour. Well, 
One hour has passed, so now preheat the oven to 170 degrees centigrade. Then lay cooking sheet on an oven tray. And place granulated sugar in a tray. And spread egg white on the dough. Then coat the dough with granulated sugar. And slice it. Then place them on a cooking sheet. Okay. Then bake it for 15 minutes. Start. Okay. Mmm, they look delicious and smells very nice. And cool them. When they get cool, serve them in a cup. Okay, that's it. It's time to eat. Itadakimasu. Mmm. It's so tasty. The hoji chai's roasted aroma is really nice. You should try it. Well, tomorrow I'll make another kind of hoji chai sweet. So, see you tomorrow.